When I ride, it just feels like everything else washes away. <laughs> Nothing is important other than what I'm doing right there. That's just the best feeling ever, that feeling of freedom from everything. My name is Mark Beaumont and I'm an endurance athlete with the current world record for cycling around the planet. Seeking adventures and finding stories is what I'm most passionate about. Ever since I can remember, I've had that sense of curiosity about the world. This time, I've come to Dubai. I'm going to meet Dana, a bike rider who's been inspiring young girls all over the UAE. I was born and raised in Dubai, so I've lived here for 25 years. I've been riding dirt bikes since I'm 15. Growing up here, my dad always taught me how to do pretty much any sport that I wanted to do. I grew up learning how to wakeboard, drive manual car, things like that. I never felt like there was anything I couldn't do just because I'm a girl. If there's a sport that I want to learn, yeah, let's go for it. There's nothing holding me back. When I started riding, it just felt natural to do that as well. I just loved it from the very beginning. So I started racing in the Emirates Desert Championship, and that's a two hour race around like a 20 to 25 kilometer loop. And I was doing a couple of those and then I started riding a bit on the motocross track and they really wanted more girls to be racing. So I did a couple of motocross races and then I did one rally, which was the Dubai International Rally. And that was probably my favorite race ever. When I tell people about riding in the desert, I describe it kind of as like surfing in the dunes. It's like you're cutting through butter, cutting through water, and it just feels so natural. It really does feel like you're just painting a canvas and you find your lines, and when you find that good line, it just feels like poetry in motion, like you're surfing the dunes, it's just perfect. The riding community here is just so open and welcoming. Maybe it is because I'm a girl that they're actually more helpful. There's so many different nationalities. You never feel like you don't belong. It's a mixture between sort of laughing and terror. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you look a lot more comfortable than just a few minutes ago. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's childlike, isn't it? It's just mm. that sheer glee. Yeah. Why yeah. did you keep going? I mean, so many people will start something and then when it's up to them, they, they do something else. But, yeah. but you, you took it to the next level. Yeah, I kept going because, I mean, for me, it was something that really changed my life at the time. I was in quite a dark place, I wasn't confident in myself. It kind of made me realize how awesome life actually can be. If the desert and the bike gave you nothing else, that, <laughs> that phrase, it showed me life could be yeah, awesome. Exactly. That would be enough, wouldn't yeah. it? No, that's the best gift I could have asked for. I would love to inspire other girls to ride. If I can give another girl that experience that I had and that feeling of self-confidence, belonging, that makes my day. At the heart of Dana, you got somebody who's very, very sweet and friendly and simply wants to show me the bike, but a fierce competitor. Like, I can see that undercurrent of, I want to push this. Just trying to keep up with her around the dunes was, was intimidating enough. I mean, it was, it was wonderful, it was eye-opening, it was, it was scary, but it was, it was seriously cool. 